What's up everyone, Trey Thousand GT here with another video. This time we're looking at the 2007 Converse CT Sale Jerry High, number the 2500. Um, this is just Converse paying homage to uh, the tattoo artist Sailor Jerry, who died back in 1973. Um, in 2002, uh, Converse licensed a lot of his artwork to be printed onto their shoes. And uh, this is one of his... Uh, one of the collaborations between Converse and his estate. So, this particular shoe, if you're looking to purchase them, I've seen them go as low as about 70 bucks, but I've seen them sell as high for 175 So, it really depends on the size, condition, um, you know, the demand for them at the time, you know. Uh, you can see that the bottom has a clear bottom. And uh, they fit, fit-wise, they um, they fit true to size, at least in my opinion. I know a lot of you guys like the chucks really tight, so you go usually go a half size down. But I prefer to have just a slight, just a little bit of room, just so I can breathe. So I stick with my true to size on the Converse Chuck Taylor. And uh, so back to the the sole of the shoe has like a girl. Um, the bottoms are clear, and then you can see that. His artwork is like stitched into the back of the shoe. It's like they cut out some felt. They they cut out the felt and just stitched it into the back of the shoe. It's really nice. And the upper is made of like nubuck, a brown nubuck. And then uh, pretty much the pictures are self-explanatory. It says death or glory on the side. It's just, it's really, it's a really nice looking shoe. Um, colors are very nice. And uh, you can see on the inside of the shoe, it's numbered. This particular pair was number 2292 of 2500. And uh, it's on the inside of the tongue. It just says Sailor Jerry. Um, it says Sailor Jerry, 1911-1973. It's when he was born. It's when he passed away. Death of glory. And that's basically it. If you have any questions, concerns, comments, as always, feel free to drop me a line. And stay tuned for more. Oh, one more thing. As you can see on the tongue. I don't know if you can see in the picture. Yeah, you probably won't be able to really make it out. These were made in um, in China. So they're not made in the USA or anything special like that. They're made in China. So, you know, the comfort on them is decent. It's, it's better than a standard chuck release. And that's basically it. Stay tuned for more videos.